Hello, today I'm going to show you how to reset or restart to the factory setting on a Chrome, uh, HP Chromebook. First, you're going to have to press on the escape key, leave it pressed down. On the refresh key, it, which is a arrow, but it's going around in a circle, leave that one pressed down as well. And then the power button, leave it pressed down for a second or two, then let go and a white screen should come up and it says please insert a recovery usb stick or sd card this is a different method our method is going to be by clicking on control leaving it pressed down and the letter d to continue our process next you're going to be asked to turn os verification off by pressing enter press enter screen goes off it'll come back on now it says OS verification is off press enter to confirm OS verification is on check mark on the screen it turns off but it'll come back on it goes on and off for a couple uh, a couple times waiting for the system to reboot completely now that the Chromebook is back on it has been power washed reset uh, and now we are going to press uh, let's go to continue choose your Wi-Fi After you press in your password uh, for your Wi-Fi, it should automatically go to the next window, which is the Google Terms of Service. If it does not, press Next. On this window, just click on Accept and Continue. Checking for updates. It's already enrolled into our system since it's a district-owned Chromebook. It says at SAUSD.us. But we want to switch that to say at sausdlearns.net. So a student will type in their, their ID number, which is the same as their lunch number, at sausdlearns. Teachers, we do it a little bit different. We actually write our name, but we still have to put at sausdlearns. It's enrolling the systems again, so it switches from at SAUSD to at SAUSDLearns.net. After this process is complete, click Done. Now you will see that it says at sausdlearns.net so the student could just type in their ID number click next and then put their password which is their birthday 